Thrivecart font size. We're going to talk about changing the font size on your Thrivecart checkout page. Now, these two screenshots are the same checkout page but with the font size sized differently. The one on the left is 75% of the default, the one on the right is 130% of the default. So there is a way to tweak that and Thrivecart does give you that capability to do so. But before we go further, I just want to warn you, there is some danger in doing this. It is possible that Thrivecart in the future will somehow block this or it won't work. Just something to be aware of. I don't think it's going to happen, but you should know that it could happen. With that said, you can make modifications to make the font size smaller or bigger and get that checkout page to look more like the way you want. So let's dive right in. So at this page here, integratepro.net forward slash thrivecart dot dash css dot php is a place that will generate the appropriate code that you need to put on into your Thrivecart uh, checkout page so that you can change the font size. Now, a little bit more of a warning. It might break things. In other words, when you do this, check to see what the page looks like. It might change the way the layout is relative to what you expect. So by default, if you were to click Submit button, it's just going to give you back exactly what the font size looks like. So it's kind of worthless to do it at 100%. You could go all the way down to 75% or all the way up to 150. My opinion, I want to go up to like 120, 130% uh, to increase the font size. So I'm going to go ahead and click Submit. It does take a little bit. I'm going to copy this code, select All. And then I'm going to copy it. I'm going to go into my Thrivecart account and I'm going to go ahead and modify one product. So I'm going to go to Edit, Customers, Tracking, and here where it says Pass, Paste Tracking Code to Add Only on Your Checkout Page, go ahead and paste it in. If something's already there, that's fine. Just go ahead and paste that in addition to what you currently have. Go ahead and save URL. I'm going to copy this link and I think this is uh, the default page. So let me just show you now what it looks like with the different font size that's a little bit bigger, 130%. So notice that if you scroll, go back and forth, there's definitely a font size different. One thing to point out is this really isn't perfectly lined up the way it was when it was at the default. So got to keep that kind of stuff in mind. So if I went up to like a bigger size, even like 150, this might not look so good. Let's go ahead and do that just to see what would happen. So I'm going to increase this all the way up to 150%. Edit the same product again, go to customers, tracking, and I will replace this and go ahead and save that. Now, if I refresh this page, it's gonna be even bigger. So in my opinion, I love it. I mean, I can see that well, but it does mess things up just a little bit. So it may not be appropriate. If you're not using a bump offer, no big deal. You've got this nice big screen. Now, for all the people out there, I think, wow, you know, even the font size is too big. Okay, let's go the other way. Let's do 75%. And then go ahead and refresh. Tiny. Now, some people that's appropriate, maybe that's what they want, but for my eyes, a little too small. Now, this will work um, on different um, checkout pages. So if I go back here, and I'm actually gonna change it once again, let's do 120 or 120%. Larger the number, the bigger the font. So 100 is the default, 120 is basically 20% greater. I'm going to go ahead and copy that and I'm going to do a couple things this time. I'll go to customers, tracking, replace the code right there and I'm going to go to checkout and let's change it to two-step checkout. 
save and get URL. And now I've bumped up the size to a bigger size. So it works with multiple templates. Um, you can also do the version where it's on your page. So let's go here. And I don't think this is going to work. So there. The embeddable checkout works on my site with the larger font size and the smaller if I want. So you can tweak the font size for Thrivecart's checkout page if you want. 